According to the National Task Force for the Elimination of Mother-to-Child Transmission of HIV and AIDS CMTCT, 25 districts of Uganda are making slow progress in the campaign. The districts that need to double their efforts to address challenges in the EMTCT program include Kabong, Amdat, Ajumani, Manafa, Nakapiripirit, Mayuge, Namaingo, Bukedia, Luka, Butareja, Bukwo, Kaliro, Kibuku, Kapchorwa, Burisa, Kiriandongo, Nakasongola, Bujiri. Jinja, Sembabule, Bududa, Mbale, Butambala, Kamuli and Kibale districts. The First Lady Janet Museveni has urged the Minister of Health to re-energize the district teams by increasing their focus on improved community engagement in the EMT City campaign. My appeal to you all, but especially to the districts which have been lagging behind, is to apply maximum effort to the EMTCT campaign in these areas. I have every confidence that with the cooperation of sensitized communities and greater attention from the Minister of Health, you will be able to achieve much better results. She thanked all stakeholders for the various roles they have played towards the success of the EMTCT campaign since it was launched in 2002. The Minister of State for Primary Health Care, Sarah Opendi Ocheng, said that as of June 2013, Uganda achieved between 30 to 40 percent declines in new HIV infections among children. So allow me just to inform you that we've come up with the indig Indigenous and Complementary Medicines Bill, which is currently in Parliament, and we hope that once that is passed in law, into law, we shall be able to address this challenge of the traditional healers. The UN resident representative, Dr. Ahuna Aziakonwa, pledged the UN agency's renewed commitment with the government to ensure that the gains in the fight against HIV and AIDS are sustained. In their resolutions, presented by the LC5 chairperson Kamuli District, Proskovia Salam Mosumba, the leaders of the 25 districts recommitted to achieve a 100% reduction of new HIV infections among children and the number of HIV pregnant and lactating mothers on antiretroviral therapy by 2015. Remija Simbonye, UBC News.